Savannah Solstice Tales of the Equator In the heart of the African savannah, where the sun kissed the land with its golden rays, lived a young storyteller named Adia. Adia was known for her vivid imagination and her ability to spin tales that transported listeners to distant realms. One evening, during the magical savannah solstice, Adia gathered the villagers around a roaring bonfire. The air was filled with a sense of anticipation as she began her tale, promising an adventure that would rival the enchantment of the solstice itself. She spoke of a time when animals and humans could communicate sharing a language of understanding and respect. In this harmonious era, a young lioness named Kaylee ventured beyond the borders of her pride, seeking to learn from the other creatures of the savannah. Her journey led her to encounters with wise elephants, swift antelopes, and playful meerkats. Each animal imparted a lesson, teaching her the values of empathy, unity, and the delicate balance of nature. As the savannah solstice approached, Kaylee had amassed a wealth of wisdom and formed deep friendships. She realized that the key to survival and harmony lay in unity and the willingness to learn from one another. In the climatic scene of the tale, as the sun reached its peak during the solstice, Kaylee gathered all the animals at a watering hole. She shared her newfound wisdom, emphasizing the importance of unity and respect for all living beings. Moved by her words and the magic of the solstice, the animals pledged to live in harmony promising to protect each other in the savannah they all called home. The savannah solstice became a symbol of this newfound understanding, celebrated by both animals and humans alike. Fostering an era of cooperation and mutual respect between all creatures of the savannah. Adia still left a lasting impression on the villagers reminding them that in the spirit of unity and understanding, they could embrace the magic of the savannah solstice every day, creating a world where all life flourished in harmony.